welcome in the last module we learn how to construct isometric views by simple method let's go ahead discussing interesting methods of drawing isometric views first we'll study box method let's illustrate an example a regular octagon has its surface parallel to hp to construct the isometric views First enclose the octagon in square box 1 2 3 4 and draw a reference line from any point one dash on a reference line draw two isometric axes one dash two dash and one dash four dash equal to sides 1 2 and 1 4 and making angles of 30 degrees with xy then complete the parallelogram 1 dash 2 dash 3 dash 4 dash from point 1 dash mark side of the octagon a dash h dash along the isometric axis observe the steps carefully likewise locate points f dash and g dash by joining all these vertices we'll get the isometric plan view of the octagon all right let's see what's next a circle or a curve does not show its true shape when it is projected as an isometric view so its isometric views are drawn by applying four center method consider a circular lamina which is positioned on hp with its surface parallel to vp observe that it displays its true shape and size in orthogonal front view now enclose the lamina in a square box a b c d then mark the midpoints 1 2 3 4 of the sides of the box To start the solution, mark a point A dash on a reference line. In isometric view, the side A dash B dash makes an angle of 30 degrees with a reference line, while the side A dash D dash is perpendicular to it. So, draw these lines and complete the box accordingly. Mark the midpoints. 1 dash 2 dash 3 dash 4 dash Now join 1 dash D dash and 4 dash B dash and mark the intersecting point as E Similarly mark intersecting point F on B dash 3 dash and D dash 2 dash Let's take B dash and D dash as centers and B dash 4 dash D dash 1 dash as radii. Draw two arcs joining 3 dash 4 dash and 1 dash 2 dash respectively. Similarly, draw two arcs joining 4 dash 1 dash and 2 dash 3 dash respectively. The ellipse obtained is the isometric view of the circle. Now let's discuss how to draw isometric views of solids. A hexagonal pyramid is resting on HP with a base side parallel to VP. Its orthogonal plan view shows true shape of the hexagonal base. So, let's construct its isometric view. For this First enclose the plan view of the pyramid in a rectangular box 1 2 3 4 5 Then from any point one double dash on reference line draw lines one double dash two double dash and one double dash four double dash making angles of 30 degrees with the line xy After that locate points B double dash C double dash E double dash F double dash by measuring the lengths of the sides of the hexagon Now locate point A double dash and D double dash as the midpoint of the side 
वन डबल डैश फोर डबल डैश एंड टू डबल डैश थ्री डबल डैश रिस्पेक्टिवली जॉइनिंग ए डबल डैश बी डबल डैश सी डबल डैश डी डबल डैश ई डबल डैश एफ डबल डैश ए डबल डैश विल फॉर्म द आइजोमेट्रिक व्यू ऑफ द हेक्सेगनल बेस सर्फेस ऑफ द पिरामिड Now draw lines to join the midpoints of the sides of the rhombus in the isometric view to obtain the intersection point R which is the center of the base. Next draw vertical axis of the pyramid RO double dash of required size. Okay let's join the apex O double dash with vertices of the base. Now Take a look at the complete isometric view of the pyramid. Observe the invisible edges are shown as dashed lines. So friends, we've learned about isometric views. For revision, you can have a quick recap of the above.